Good evening YouTube, it's MakiKuno1 here and I just wanted to give you sort of a random card discussion. Uh, the cards I want to do today are the Medolce Hollows, Magdalene, and Pudding Sets. I'll be going over their strengths, weaknesses, and what they can do outside of their archetype. Okay, let's go with more, more height of the two, I guess. Medolce Magdalene. She is level 4, Earth, Spellcaster, 1400 attack, 1200 defense, and her effect reads When this card you control is destroyed by your opponent's card effect, either no, destroyed by your opponent's card, either by battle or card effect, and sent to your graveyard, shuffle this card into your deck. When this card is normal or flip summoned, you can add one adult chain monster from your deck to your hand. Now obviously you play three Magellines in in a Madolce deck. That kind of goes without saying, it searches out any monster you need. What I want to discuss today is people just plunking a playset of Magellene in other decks like Psychics. Now while I understand that it can search for itself and so recurs and when it dies it shuffles itself back into the deck so you can just keep a loop going of them. I personally don't like it in Psychics or anything else other than Medolce simply because if you Xyz with it or Synchro with it it doesn't go back to the deck, it just sits in the grave. I, mean, I know it gives um, an Eteli engine for example access to Arcanite stuff like that and Tempest Magician I think it does as well but um, I just don't think it's that great. I mean, you might as well just run a gadget or something. And we haven't seen gadget psychics ever, so I I don't I don't approve of it being splash and everything. Uh, as I said, you play three in in Medolce, No questions asked. It's an amazing card. Um, for the archetype. It's a sugary stratos, pink gadget, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. My two cents on that. Next card. Pudding sets. My thoughts on this card have gone up a little bit since release, but I still think it's fairly iffy. Um, I, I hope my camera will actually focus now. Um, but yeah. It's an Earth, like all Medolce's, level 5, Fairy, uh, 1000 attack, 1000 defense, that's kind of where I don't like it, it's a bit too weak starting off, but the fact is, when this card you control is destroyed by your opponent's card, either by battle or card effect, and sent to your graveyard, shuffle this card into your deck, that's with all Medolce's. Uh, while you can have no monsters in your graveyard, this card gains 800 attack and defense. After damage calculation, when this card battles an opponent's monster, you can target one card your opponent controls, destroy that target. That's even if she dies, or if, even if she would die from the battle. Um, she's 1800 with her effect, 2-3 with the field spell. I still don't really think that's of good enough stats for a, a tribute monster. I mean, I know most of the time you're just going to search out with Magdalene and then next turn Normal Summon, Mufi, and Special her. But, again, I'm not terribly sold on it. Um, obviously she does nothing for any deck outside Medolce, really because if you're going to tribute some of her you might as well run Caius or something. Um, yeah. I don't think that putting Cess builds will be around for much longer because once um, once Abyss Rising comes out and we get uh, Messengelato and Crufson and Tiramisu especially um, putting Cess becomes kind of obsolete 
which is kind of which is kind of disappointing in the way, in a way because um, you know the deck starts becoming good, but the deck's first boss monster becomes a bit redundant. Um, yeah, if she if she started off at fifteen each, so she um, with her effect and what's called the chateau goes up to two nine. I think that would be a lot better. Then she might actually be able to be over something rather than just ram something and pop it. Uh, the only real good combo I can see with Pudding Cess is summoning it with Mewfi, um, ramming something, Mewfi dies as well in the same battle phase and you get them both both to the hand um, via Chateau and you can keep doing that and popping stuff but that won't that kind of grinds itself down fairly quick and your opponent will probably just destroy you before then <laughs> yeah it's just been a random video I felt like making um, sub if you like it click on thumbs up I'd appreciate it. Thank you very much, and good night.